everyone, welcome back to Three Strands Homestead. Today we are going to be doing a little mulching. I've done a few different videos on the mulcher, the Alpha Wolf XP, and I really just, I don't want to keep doing the same video, but in a sense it's going to be the same. I'm going to be clearing in all of all those, those videos. But what I'm trying to do is, is trying to get enough information out there on it. So if you decide to buy one, um, you'll, you'll know what you're getting. Um, this is a piece of property that we actually bought, uh, it's eight and a half acres. There's a lot of timber on this, Lord willing, we will clear a lot of the timber, sell it, but there's a lot of just brush lot of brush that we're gonna have to get rid of before we can do anything with this property and so <clears throat> my goal for today in this video is I want to show you how efficient the machine is so I'm gonna set I'm gonna set a two hour um, just a, a two hour timer and I'm gonna go through here and see how much I can get done in two hours um, a lot of this stuff is just, it's just weeds. It's, I'll be honest with you, it's really nothing, a lot of this stuff is really nothing a zero turn mower could do. I mean, but there are stumps in here, old rotten stumps. So obviously you wouldn't want to do that with your mower. There's down, there are down eight inch trees. There's probably, um, I see some bigger 10 inch trees in there. They're all pine, they're all softwood. Um, but they're just they're just laying on the ground and of course you wouldn't want to mow over that so That's why I'm gonna brush cut but um, a lot of it a lot of it is just Stuff like this you can pour out of the ground and then you have little one inch. This is a little one inch tree The water oak so that's really what we're dealing with all throughout here, so it should go fairly quick um, actually, I know it. I know it will. So, I want to show y'all how well it does on this kind of stuff. And uh, later on, I'll do a video on on how it does on thicker, thicker material, um, more of your four, five, even six inch stuff. Um, the machine is capable of doing ten inches. I've done ten inch stuff with it. I've probably done a little bit bigger. Uh, it's not something that you want to go do day in, day out with it. And it's certainly not something you want to do whenever, if you have a, a large, uh, say you're clearing an acre and it has just a bunch of 10 inch stuff, that's not the right machine to do it with. Uh, just because it can do it doesn't mean that you necessarily should do it. Um, I would say if you have your occasional 10 inch tree, sure, why not? But, but this is really more of what <coughs> this machine is for is what you see here it this is where it's going to perform at its peak is is through stuff like this so anyway i hope you enjoy the video so please uh stay tuned watch uh if you do like it um please just uh subscribe subscribe you never know what we're going to put out in this channel we um we do so many different things uh we homestead if you haven't watched any of our other videos, check those out. Uh, we are kind of on the down low right now on the homesteading, uh, taking a little bit of a break um, on the homestead. And uh, this is just what I do for a living. Um, I clear trees. I do, you know, uh, land clearing, dirt work, all kinds of different stuff. So you just you never know what you're going to get with with this channel. So anyway, please just like, share, and subscribe if you would and uh, you'll get all the videos we put out. All right, hope you enjoy.
So, I don't know if you can tell much of a difference. Hopefully you can. But, so I'm right at two hours, I think two hours and five minutes. And, I, I think I probably cleared about half an acre, right at half an acre. Um, so it went actually a little slower than what I thought, but that's only because um, I got a little bit further back over here and I was um, I was mulching up some five and six inch trees so and the blades on this thing are not the sharpest right now so I have some new blades coming but these I have to get them it's good for the little stuff but whenever it gets to your I actually did like an 8 inch tree, um, whenever I got down to the stump it was more like 10 inches. So it did it, and it, it, it did it okay, but it's not the, the most efficient and I wouldn't, uh, I certainly would not recommend running uh, dual blades on, I don't know, anything, anything bigger than 3 inches. Really, you, you shouldn't run dull blades at all. So I don't recommend ever running dull blades. But anyway, uh, so yeah, if you would, just kind of walk through, just follow, follow me. So I didn't spend a, I didn't spend a lot of time on back dragging a lot of stuff, um, other than the the bigger, some of the bigger stuff. So. I would typically, like anything like this, uh, I would typically go through and back drag, but, <clears throat> and then turn it more into, turn it more into, you know, little pieces like this, but look at this, I mean, this was all like that over there, and well, dirt. So, so uh, a lot of it was just uh, yopon, two inch, two inch yopon. A lot of it was smaller. like this I mean that's a that's a good six inch tree right there at the base that's um, definitely gonna be nearly a 10 inch stump and and I'll work those stumps all the way into the ground you can just tilt the the uh, head forward and the knives will or the blades will just dig right into the dirt and it'll take the, the stump all the way below ground level <laughs> Yeah, I mean it. It opened it up a good, a good bit. So back here, I'm trying to find a. I should have left a stump a little higher and, and and actually put my foot on it. But I I took them all the way under ground level, so. There was quite a few bigger trees right through here that took. It it takes it takes a little time, like uh, doing a doing a tree like this right here. Um, this tree, um, definitely a good seven inch seven inch tree. To do this tree with uh, sharp knobs, probably two minutes. So two minutes and completely gone and this is uh this is a tall tree i mean um this is about 40 foot tall 
40 foot tall. I'm going to say three minutes. I better say three minutes. Just to, you know, I'd rather overdo it than underdo it. So, three minutes, 40 foot, seven inch tree gone, 10 inch stump, maybe even a little bit bigger. So, <clears throat> Once again, this is the Alpha Wolf XP brush cutter. Um, it's it's a monster of a machine. I mean, if you're looking to uh, if you're looking to you just get one to clear some of your property um, or get one for business purposes, and you're not maybe you can't afford to get uh, one of the higher dollar um, drum mulchers or disc mulchers this thing really does uh, just as good of a job on certain jobs it's actually more efficient if I would say if you were doing if you were doing a job full of full of that kind of stuff over there like where it's just one two inch stuff this is going to outperform the it will outperform both of the other ones the disc and the and the drum it's it's wider it's 72 inches and it's it's just I guess I can't say 100% like, hey, this is this is just going to outperform every time. I can't say that because I haven't ran, I haven't ran the other ones. Now I've done a lot of research on the other ones, and just based upon the research that I've done, I, this is um, it doesn't bog down and stuff like that. It just you can go over it as fast as you want to, and and turn and go, you know, just. Anyway, it's it's really efficient. So I, I, I definitely I don't want to say I don't want to say anything uh, bad about the other ones because the other ones have its purposes and and they're good machines. They're really good machines. So, but I think that these are just underrated. Um, and a lot of people don't know what they can do. They just think that they can bush hog and maybe do a little bit thicker. But no, that these things can. You know, they can. Once again, handle a 10 inch tree. Would not recommend that all day, every day. Um, five inch material, all day, every day. All day, every day, five inch material. So, yeah. I guess that's, uh, that's gonna wrap it up on this video. So, Y'all take care. Thank you for watching the videos. And once again, if you like it, like, subscribe, share it. And we'll keep putting out videos. Y'all have a good day. Take care.